All right, I wasn't gonna get a trial deck, but one of these popped up and I thought I'd give it a try and record my opening just in case we win the lottery. Again, I do not condone this. If you're looking purely to make money on opening boxes, do not because this is pretty much just gambling. Only, only open these if you truly, truly, truly enjoy it, okay? So let's get this open real quick. But as I mentioned, there's so many of these popping up and over time, you're gonna see more and more people get these in the mail because, so don't fall into this like hype pricing. You're gonna see more and more of these trial decks pop up and as more of these things get open, more of these cards are going to show up and these prices will not stay. Or if, even if so, right? Don't pay someone like a thousand something dollars for these cards. It's just ridiculous. Alright, let's go into our first one. If I can get this open. Jesus. Okay. I'm going to our first trial deck. See if we either get the Rudy or the Roxy. I think the fact that you get an SR in the front means that you didn't get it right. Nope, we didn't get it in this one. These to the side. I guess I could cut these open ahead of time. The good thing about trial decks is, like, if you're just looking to play with them, or like if you had friends that want to get into the game, they make pretty good starter decks. Of course, you're going to need like multiple of them. Okay, not this one either. I feel like when you open like a ton of these, you end up with just a lot of junk. And a lot of cardboard waste. Bro, well, well, I bought trial decks before, like the Overlord one back then. Or even like the Disgaea ones. And I've never got a trial deck SP outside of, I think, the Marvel trial deck SP. I got that. But as for like things like the Seven Deadly Sins and stuff, I've never gotten it out of those. Guess I could just make a pile here. I believe it's always on the back as well too. So normally you'll I do see a foil back there. Oh, I got the Rudeus. Nice. Okay, so not the Roxy, but I did get a Rudy TDSP. So that's pretty cool. Alright, let me just sleeve this up. Yeah, overall I'm pretty happy. It ended up getting a TDSP which I've never pulled myself before so it's pretty cool it's not like the chase chase card but it's still pretty exciting I'm, I just kind of wanted to join in on the fun and I figured I'd record opening normally I don't get jack squat like I said when I opened the seven deadly sins one I got like nothing at all but yeah I still have like two remaining that I didn't open but uh that's one thing I again you have to watch out for people that are pulling these um 
trial decks, they're pretty much selling the remaining ones. So technically, if I'm like a bad person, I could sell these remaining ones as open ones and try to scam people out of it. But that's that's a terrible thing to do. Normally, I, what I do with trial decks, I just end up selling them as open products, even if they're sealed. So that way, you know, people don't feel like they got bamboozled. Yeah, pretty cool. Thank you for watching.